So here we go. In no particular order, we'll be announcing the top eight finalists. And we begin with Miss Arima. Advancing to the top eight. The second delegate advancing to the top eight. Let's give it up for Miss Santa Cruz. Advancing to the top eight, ladies and gentlemen, help me bring to the front Miss Aruka. Only four spots left. Will it be? Fifth place goes to Miss Los Bajos. In the top eight goes to Miss Maloney Garden. <sighs> now it's really tense. Final two. Final two. Who will it be? Who will it be? Miss Shaguana! Wow! Ladies and gentlemen, we have one spot left. Who will that lucky girl be? Advancing, the final delegate. Advancing to the top eight. Desiree, you look beautiful tonight. Did I tell you how wonderful you look? Thank you, Leander. <laughs> the final delegate, ladies and gentlemen. Advancing to the top eight in Miss Teen Awareness 2017 goes to Miss Miss Tobago. Each delegate scores were tallied from their pre-judging competition as well as tonight's scores. Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. Congratulations to the top eight. All of their hard work has paid off. 
The remaining delegates, we say thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. So as the delegates exit, we say thank you very much. Yeah. Audience, you're going to give them a beautiful round of applause for all of their hard work. At this time, the top eight delegates will be carrying 3% of their preliminary scores into the second round of the competition. In this segment, the delegates will be put to the challenge by testing their knowledge. Each delegate would have submitted a written question surrounding the topic suicide awareness and all questions have been placed together in a bowl where each delegate would randomly select a question. And so we begin. Ladies and gentlemen, this is for your information. The delegates will be given 30 seconds to answer their question. After the 30 seconds, a chime will go off and that brings them to the end of their question. The first delegate in the question and answer round will be Miss Arima. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Miss Arima. <laughs> Miss Arima, you will go to the center. We ask for silence, please. Ms. Arima, as teenagers, what are some of the things that you can take upon yourself in order to help prevent suicide in your country? And this question comes from Ms. Teen Awareness Santa Cruz. One more time. As teenagers, what are some of the things that you can take upon yourself in order to help prevent suicide in your country. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. Being a teenage girl and a teenager on the whole, I would promote self-acceptance to lessen the suicide levels in Trinidad and Tobago because we don't know how much, how much we think about ourselves, how our self-acceptance, how our self-confidence, our esteem how it brings, how it shows on ourselves. So I would like to tell girls and boys, young like myself, to be confident with who you are. Be confident in your own skin, be comfortable. Society does not define what beauty is. You define what beauty is. Thank you, Miss Arima. Miss Arima will be followed by Miss Santa Cruz. <laughs> Miss Santa Cruz, your question comes from Miss Teen Awareness Shagornas. According to the World Health Organization, where does Trinidad and Tobago rank on the suicide list, both in the Caribbean and internationally? Silence, please. That question again. According to the World Health Organization, where does Trinidad and Tobago rank on the suicide list, both in the Caribbean and internationally. Good, e good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, judges and my fellow delegates. Not just in Trinidad, but in the Caribbean, suicide is the second most leading cause of death. And As young adults, like myself, as we get older, our hormones are changing, we face many difficulties at home, in school, and as parents, friends, teachers, should make it their duty to look out for the young adults because we are the future. Thank you. Thank you. 
Miss Santa Cruz makes way for Miss St. Joseph. This question comes from Miss Teen Awareness, Maloney Gardens. It is a physiological fact that it is a physiological fact that suicide is caused by insanity. What are your views on this? That question again. It is a physiological fact that suicide is caused by insanity. What are your views on this? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My view on this is, it is that it is not caused by insanity fully because there are other aspects that can lead to suicide for example, bullying, abuse, and financial issues, and so forth, just to name a few. Therefore, you cannot blame insanity on the whole for suicide. Thank you. Thank you very much, Miss St. Joseph. Miss St. Joseph, ladies and gentlemen, makes way for Miss Shaguanas. This question comes from Miss Teen Awareness Arima. What do you think is the greatest contribution to teen suicide in Trinidad and Tobago, and how can we resolve it? What do you think is the greatest contribution to teen suicide in Trinidad and Tobago, and how can we resolve it? Good evening, judges, specially invited guests, ladies and gentlemen. I believe that the cause of suicide among teenagers within Trinidad and Tobago is bullying. Bullying can lead anyone to committing suicide. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ms. Shaguanas. Ms. Shagonas makes way for Ms. Los Bajos. This question comes from Ms. Teen Awareness Lavantil. What actions should be taken to help struggling teenagers and also help reduce the suicide rate in Trinidad and Tobago? What actions should be taken to help struggling teenagers and also help reduce the suicide rate in Trinidad and Tobago? Good afternoon, everyone. I believe that the government that we as the people in this country, I believe that persons of this community should come together to keep forums to help educate persons on suicide, to bring awareness to the problem, and to help promote self-acceptance self among youths. Because the youths are our future. We are the future. And if there is no youths, can you imagine? Thank you very much, Miss Los Bajos. Los Bajos makes way for Miss Aruka.
Unfortunately, Miss Aruka pulled her own question. <laughs> so we asked her to pull again. This question comes from Miss Tina Wainis, St. Joseph. What can you do to help someone that is thinking about suicide acts? What can you do to help someone that is thinking about suicidal acts? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> what I think, in my opinion, we can all be our brother's keeper. Just showing a simple act of kindness can really save a person's life. Because you, you can't look at somebody to tell they are depressed or anything. You have to talk to them and get to know them. And, you know, eventually they might open up to you so that you can try to help them and let them know they are not alone. And that's who I want to tell everybody that today, that you are not alone. Thank you very much, Miss Aruka. Miss Aruka makes way for Miss Maloney Gardens. This paper has two questions from two delegates, so I ask her to pull again. This question comes from Miss Tina Awareness, Coconut Drive. Do you think the media plays a significant role as to how so society addresses suicide? Do you think the media plays a significant role as to how society addresses suicide? Thank you, and may I say, very interesting question. I do believe that the media plays a very significant role in addressing the issue of suicide. The media would show a young girl that it's okay to starve herself to death. They would show a young man that it is okay to shoot someone and when he does go to jail, in turn, commit suicide. So therefore, the media, I hold you responsible for addressing this issue of suicide. Thank you. Thank you very much, Miss Maloney Gardens. <laughs> Miss Maloney Gardens makes the way for Mr. Bago. This question comes from Miss Teen Awareness, Lady Young. Which Caribbean country is ranked third highest suicide rate within the region? Which Caribbean country is ranked third highest suicide rate within the region? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, especially invited guests, and to you, my judges. In my opinion, I believe that Trinidad and Tobago would be ranked the, most ha the third highest in the re country that has suicide in the region. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it, our beautiful delegates in their top eight, and they have answered.